Okay, Mel, here's how I log into one of my pages so that whenever I post on somebody else's page, it'll show up with the name of the page you want them to see. And in this case, it's Mel Jackson for Supervisor of Elections. So this is what my page looks like. On mine, I assume yours is the same way. You've got a home button up here and a Mac button. Mac is for your personal stuff, so I'll take you through this and show you how it works for me. You click on the home page, and then you've got all this stuff over here, and all this here, I don't know what this is, ads and everything. Here's a picture of Richard Petty. I'll probably like that in his early days. And then over here on this side, you've got this column, like in my case, it's Mac Payne, my page, my personal page, edit page. Then it's got all these headings like favorites. I've got all these favorites. Then you come on down here and I've got pages. That's what we're looking for, but I'll show you some more. Groups and friends and other things. You should be interested in pages. So you click on the pages sign. And then on mine, I get this list of my pages. I have a whole bunch of them I put up there. But the one you're interested, the one I'm interested in, and the one you'd be interested in, I'm interested in Vietnam Veteran News because that's the page for the podcast. Yours is Mel Jackson running for office. Then you come over here and you log in. Now, before we log in, notice up here, it's Mac Payne. That's the page that's up here. When I log in to VietnamVeteranNews.com, suddenly that's the name up there that's the page that we're on vietnam veteran news and every time i post somewhere let's say for instance i go to let's just say where do i see somebody let me find a page to go to let's go in here to say um mel jackson Politician, where are you? Sometimes it's <clears throat> you really got to put them in here to find the right ones here. Let's just say Mel Jackson and search. Look at all these Mel Jacksons down here. Holy moly. The only reason there's so many of them in here is because on this particular... Oh, there it is. Oh, it showed up. Okay, now, when I go to your page, in this case, Mel Jackson for DeSoto County Supervisor of Elections, and I, I'm going to post something. Let's say... Uh, how do I vote for you Okay, I've typed that in there, and then I'm going to post it. You wrote on Mel Jack. I don't know what they're doing here. Now let me find it. I want to show you what it looks like. Where is my post? View the post. Your post appears here. Post admin will also receive a notification. Oh, you've got the way this page is set up over here. Visitor poster over here. But visitor post, it says Vietnam Veteran News posted. If you were doing that, you sign into your page every time you would post on somebody else's page it would come up with Mel Jackson for supervisor of elections and then when you're done you have to log out 
so if I want to get back to my page from Vietnam Veteran News, I go over here and I log out. Let's see. And then I'm going to sign back in. And now I'm back to my page. And that's how you do it. So for political purposes, every time you want to use Facebook, you always and talk about your campaign and stir up interest and whatever. You always want to come over here, go to your home page, then come over here to the left side, come to the pages, click on pages, and then find the page you want to go sign into, like here, Vietnam Better News. Log into it. You log into it, and they'll go and make your post, and it'll show all your posts coming from that page, and then everyone who responds to your post, it'll that page will show up on their timelines, and supposedly, lots of people will see it and respond and vote for you and put you into office. If you have any questions, give me a call. Talk to you later.